Hey guys, what's up? Hi everyone, Jai Hind. This is Ananya, your SSC Master Teacher at Vidangri. I hope I'm clearly audible. Yes. All right, that's super guys. Good one. Okay. So, uh, guys, first of all, if you people are new to this channel, do not forget to subscribe to this channel and also hit the like button. It is absolutely free. Thank you so much in advance. So, guys, what I'm going to teach you in this particular video. Guys, in this video, I'm going to revise the topic of types of farming from the chapter agriculture. Okay. So, this is going to be a very, very, very important session from your term one point of view. So, make sure that you guys are there till the end of this session. Cool? Chalo, let's get started. But guys, before I start with this session, a very, very important announcement for everyone. And guys, let me tell you the thing which I'm going to tell you now. It is just superb, guys. Guys, we have come up with 50% off on all the courses up to rupees 2000. Yes. And guys, this is going to be there only till 19th of October. From 15th to 19th of October, guys. That's it. 50% off on all the courses. So still, if you are not a part of Vedantus 9, uh, Vedantus Pro subscription, now this is a time wherein you guys can take the subscription. If you have already taken, I want you guys to tell your friends, Share this video with all your friends. Share the coupon code of AD Pro and take flat 50% off on all the plans. Yes, you have heard it right. Now, guys, we are providing term one crash course. As you know, there are many, many, many advantages. Okay, what are the advantages? We'll definitely tell you in this particular video, but I want you guys to stay till the end of this video. All right. Before that, guys, let me tell you our term one crash course is for just rupees 5000 and initially when you used to apply my coupon code ad pro you used to get 10 percent off that was 4500 used to, you used to get the course but now if you apply the same code look at the price 3000 simple and if you take the classic subscription previously uh, you used to get uh, uh, the course at 4950 I remember after applying my coupon code as AD Pro but now you will get the same thing at 3500 but then just spending 500 rupees extra you will get the Pro Classic subscription what is the difference between Light and Classic in Classic you will get a Doubt app means after the class you can ask unlimited questions and there are many advantages if you people are not aware guys I want you guys to stay to the end of this video. We'll definitely guide you. But there are many, many micro courses, crash courses. What are the advantages? We'll definitely tell you guys. Uh, guys, the batches are going to start soon. 11th October it all. It is already started. And on 8th of November it will start. And not only crash course, guys. You can take term 1, term 2 courses. You can take NTAC crash course. You can take NTAC crash courses. Foundation courses. And there are many, many courses. Just go in the description box. You can browse the courses, browse the website and have a look on each and every course. Okay, till 19th of this month, October, you will get flat 50% off up to rupees 2000 on all the courses. So do not miss on this opportunity, guys. All right, chalo. So people, let's get started with this session, types of farming. All right, before we understand about the types of farming, let's understand some basics. Guys, as we know, agriculture is a primary activity. Okay. So, in India, guys, most of the people are engaged into agricultural activities. Like two-thirds of India's population is engaged in agriculture. Now, it produces food for our consumption and also raw materials for many agro-based industries. Yes, so it supports many agro-based industries also. People, farming can be classified into three major types. Primitive subsistence farming intensive subsistence farming and commercial farming let's understand each and every type of farming in detail the very first one we have is primitive subsistence farming guess what is the meaning of primitive uh, which is followed from the ancient times all right so it is carried out by small farmers on small patches of land basically it is followed by the tribals in india all right 
guys they use primitive tools like hoe dow digging stake let me show you the images like this is dow digging stake hoe all right so guys these are the tools used by used in the primitive subsistence farming by the farmers or the tribal people all right cool now guys it is totally dependent upon rainfall and the natural fertility of the soil means they do not use any kind of fertilizers chemical fertilizers and like pesticides or they are not dependent upon irrigation cool so guys it is also called slash and burn agriculture now guys what is known as slash and burn agriculture let's understand guys okay now guys why primitive subsistence farming is called slash and burn agriculture guys in this what happens the farmers clear a patch of forest like they burn the plants or the woodland whatever is there they burn they clear the patch of forest they burn the plants and uh, all these stuffs uh, to get a field okay this field is known as sudden s w i d d e n all right and uh, what they do the burnt plants provide nutrients to the soil okay on which they do agricultural activities once the fertility of the soil reduces they switch to other piece of land so this is known as slash and burn agriculture i hope you understood this cool all right now guys the name of slash and burn agriculture is different in every uh, like country okay so this is the list of the names of slash and burn agriculture in different countries all right you guys can pause the video take the screenshot or you guys can make a note of this or else you can do one thing after this session uh, you can download the pdf from the description box all right if you guys are not aware the pdf of this particular session is available in the description box after this video cool you guys can download it next now guys this is the name of slash and burn agriculture in different states of india all right in madhya pradesh andhra pradesh odisha western ghats so on and so forth coming to the next one intensive subsistence farming okay lot of work is done in intensive subsistence farming that is what is known as intensive okay lot of work is done now guys it is practiced in areas of high population pressure on land means the countries like india where the population is huge and the availability of the land is very less so we have to utilize this land uh, fully throughout the year all right so here we do intensive subsistence farming all right it is a labor intensive farming what is known of labor intensive more number of laborers are used as compared to machines and it is dependent upon heavy biochemical inputs like intensive irrigation hyg seeds uh, like chemical fertilizers and also stuffs so basically chemical fertilizer pesticides irrigation modern farming inputs are used to get maximum production from the land next one we have is commercial farming all right so guys what is commercial farming agricultural practice on a large scale by using modern technology to earn good income is called commercial farming simple as that so to earn good income we use modern technology modern farming techniques and it is basically to earn good income that is commercial farming okay what are the features of commercial farming let's understand first large land holding okay second use of high level of inputs like hyg seeds good irrigation facilities chemical fertilizers insecticides pesticides are used to get maximum production out of it that's it and finally we have is plantation all right so guys commercial and plantation there is a difference guys in plantation let's understand how it is different from commercial guys in plantation it produces raw material for various agro based industries yes okay so only a single crop is grown on a large scale it uses capital intensive input what is our capital intensive lot of machines are used with the help of migrant laborers it requires good network of transport communication market facilities all right for the transportation of all the produce raw, uh, raw material to the industries okay some of the crops which are grown is rubber sugar cane banana and many other like coffee in karnataka tea in assam and north bengal so these are some of the crops which are grown in plantation farming that's it that's it i hope you understood the session 
If yes, do not forget to like this video. All right. Share this video with all your friends. Cool. Now, guys, if you are new or yes, if you guys are new and if you are not aware, guys, let me tell you. If you take our pro subscription from 15th of October till 19th of October, we have the Sera 50% off on all our plans. On all our plans up to rupees 2000. So let me guide you guys why you should take our pro subscription. First of all, guys, unlimited live classes. Like this is a recorded class. You know the difference between a recorded and a live session. In live session, you can interact with the teachers. You can ask unlimited questions. All right. And in a live session, you basically participate with students throughout the world. Because in Vedanta, students are not only from India. They are from different countries as well. Yes. You can watch the session replays. And these are not plain replays. These are interactive replays. Means first of all, n number of times you can watch the replays. And you can still participate in the quiz, like a live session. You can download the notes, which are made by your master teachers. You can ask unlimited questions, not only during the class, but after the class also. Just imagine. Tests are taken. Assignments are given to you. You have an access to micro courses and craft courses. People micro courses are topic specific courses. Let's take an example. You attended a live session of uh, agriculture. Now, once again, you wish to attend a live session of agriculture. You can get the micro course of that topic and it can be taught by other master teacher from Vedantu. So you are basically getting varieties. No need to pay extra for these micro courses. Crash courses are revision courses. Everything is going to be unlimited for you. And do you know, now you guys are getting this course at just... Yeah, initially I told you guys at just 3000 rupees guys. Okay, let me show you if you guys missed out this thing. Let me show you guys. You are getting the course. It was 5000 rupees after applying my coupon code. It was 4500. Now, if you apply my coupon code AD Pro, it is coming down to rupees 3000. And this offer is there only till 19th of October. If you take classic, you will get the down sap. That 5,500 will come down to 3,500 after applying my coupon code AD Pro. So guys, do not miss on the opportunity. The link is there in the description box. How you guys can access it? It's very simple, guys. Like let's say this is one of my video on YouTube. All right, just go to Show More. This is the description box. Avail all exciting courses. Okay, just click over here. Select your class. You are in class 10. Want to take term one crash course yeah whatever course you want to take guys previously it was deco let's say if i remove my coupon code it was 5000 if you apply ad pro it will come down to 4500 but now now guys, this is a recorded session but now if you apply the same code it will come down to rupees 3000 and guys this is there only till 19th of this month so make sure that guys you sub, you take our pro subscription there are many 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 advantages right so uh, thank you so much guys for attending my session i hope you had a great time you understood each and everything if yes do not forget to like this video and share this video with all your friends all right thank you so much guys i'll see you in my next video till then take very very good care of yourself bye bye guys take care jai hind